This webinar will demonstrate how to create a user account in Arctos. Although you don't need an account to search the Arctos portal, an account is required for downloading data and for saving searches. It's worth knowing that Arctos will not share your personal information and will never send you spam. You can also find written instructions for setting up a user account in the Arctos handbook. Just go to the How To section and select New Operator User Account. As you can see, the instructions for creating a new user account start with a visit to the Arctos portal. Once your Arctos user account is set up, you can log in from this main portal page up here in the right hand corner. But this is also where you can start to create your user account. First, you'll want to enter your username, and your username must only use letters and numbers, A through Z, 0 through 9, and cannot begin with a number. Next, you'll need to add a password. Uh, passwords are a little more complicated. Your password must contain at least six characters. Start with a letter. Use only A through Z, 0 through 9, and a certain subset of special characters. It cannot contain your username, and it must consist of at least one letter, one number, and one special character. Once you've entered your password, simply click Create Account. And now you've created an Arctos user account. Make sure you remember your username and password so that you can log in later for your saved searches or download data in the future. The next step in creating a new user account is to set up your profile and you do that at My Stuff. And on this page, you want to fill out the fields in yellow. They're required. And then a couple of the other fields as well. So the affiliation field um, is where you would probably put your school or your employer, just whatever affiliation you have that's bringing you to Arctos. If you are just searching for personal business, then maybe you can just put Arctos here. You want to be sure and put an email account. because that will allow you to retrieve your password should you lose it. You can also select your preferred file format for downloads here, and I uh, think CSV is usually what people use. There are some other settings below that you might look at later when you're more sophisticated in your searching, but for right now, if you'll fill out the top part of the profile, then you should be in good shape. So click Save Profile, and um, now you're logged into Arctos with your profile saved. You're an official Arctos user, and we welcome you to the community. If you're interested in the other options in, within Arctos, searching and the portals, please view some of our other uh, screencasts. Thanks.